Welcome back to your Caribou Data Science channel. Today is, well, today is uh, Monday, June the, the uh, oops, Monday, June the 26th, 2021. I'm going to give you a brief demonstration of how to import almost 4 million rows, 4 million records into a database in under one, in, in a minute, in a minute or less, okay? The database of choice, the weapon of choice here, is the SQLite database. In order, to, in order to perform this this magic, you need two things. You need the SQLite database, and you need the DB browser. I'll include the links to both of those both of those uh, uh, sources in the description below. But what you do, you, you what I did, I simply installed the DB browser. Then I took the other files which I downloaded. Uh, from the web, uh, well, let me explain this very quickly because it's a little confusing. DB browser is easy, easy to find. Download that, install it. Come to SQLite side, go to download page, and install two things. Windows 64. This is this is the libraries and stuff. And this bundle here, which gives you a couple of command line tools. This is the main one. So unzip these, put them in, put them somewhere in your pass. You create a directory maybe, and put them in your and put the directory in your pass name. I put mine in in the in the directory where the DB browser is installed. Okay, very fast, very quick. Okay. So now that's the that's the uh, now we're now we got everything installed. Let's open up DB browser. Let's start the clock. Go create a new database. We're going to call it, we're just, we're just going to call it um, a new database and file or CSV. And we're going to import the 12 month worth of data for the cyclistic. Uh, database for the cyclistic uh, ride sharing data. Okay, so now we're going to import all 12 of those files. Done. What do we got? 3.4, let's say 3.5 million records in 56 seconds. Okay, you you probably couldn't import one, <laughs> there's no way in, in, uh, you know, that you can do this with say MySQL or Mariah database, okay? The, needless to say that uh, the SQL database Claim to fame as it's fall as it's a very small footprint and it's lightning fast. It's just lightning fast. Now the downside is it's not really a downside is it doesn't have the full range of data types. For instance, it doesn't have a time, a date, or timestamp data type. Dates have to be imported in as characters. Okay. Now you can use SQL commands like cast and stuff to convert it to a date type, for instance. Okay, but but again, as you saw, 3.4 million records in under a minute. That is that is the claim to fame for, uh, for SQLite. Okay, thanks so much for your time. Hopefully, this has encouraged you to go out and and work with and, and use the SQLite. Okay. Fast, light, and of course, completely free to use. Thanks so much, uh, Google Data Analytics and Caribou Data Science Channel. We'll catch you at another time with some with some new reports.